Hello, this is Dr. Fujian in the Ask Me segment. Um, a wonderful lady has asked, um, what is, how can we have a life full of purpose after 60? She is um, growing in the age of 60 and she's trying to find what to do um, if she's not going to have her career anymore. This conversation is really close to my heart because I am exactly between 59 and 60. November, I will be 60. So this conversation of aging has been a conversation for a while that I've been um, experiencing from age 40 and then 50s and then 60s and then work with people who are in their 70s and 80s and 90s and are so much into um, growth and not only their own growth, but also giving to the community. So how I would say it is, we give, we create and give and receive love as a child with our family and parents and then our peers and then our intimate relationship and then work and career environment and then having children, you know, their love to us or our grandchildren to us and then the society at large. And as we grow, I think that this concept of the wisdom that we have, the personal experience and the experience that we've gained from the world through out the ages as how the technology has changed and given us the um, um, the, the wisdom or uh, the medical industry, every aspect of what is out there can be a wow because in every single industry, the growth is so amazing. That is exciting. You'll never be bored because if you ever took anything upon yourself to learn, the vast amount of knowledge and experience is so much. So the purpose beyond 60 could be learning new aspects of life, which you've never known before. And, you know, like a child who gets excited about learning, learn, learn, learn until the day you die, or give, give, give until the day you die, which, or you could learn and give all at the same time, which is probably the best way of creating where you could have that joy where you don't have to do anything or know anything or um, there's no more have to's. We've done our have to's. We usually get to an age around 60 and up where we just choose to. And I think that's the beauty of life, getting to choose all that you want to and get excited about choosing. So create your own purpose, maybe all the way to this age. You have um, lived based on everybody else's or the community, the society and your family's uh, basis of who you should have been and how you should have reacted and what your knowledge should have been. And maybe today is uh, the time you choose. It's mine. And uh, I get to do whatever I want. I've gotten to the age which I deserve to do whatever I want and not caring necessarily that, you know, if it's going to handle uh, anybody else's satisfaction. Obviously, as a social being, we'd like to create a group in, uh, around us that we socialize and we care about each other and give and receive love. But beyond anything, remember, at the day of your deathbed, where you look back at these uh, 30, 40 years uh, beyond 60, and you say, did I do everything that I wanted to do? Is there anything that is left that I haven't done? Is there anything in my bucket list that I want to do? And I think that is the excitement that gives us the being and uh, the joy and the passion. So Live every day like it is your last day and yet enjoy every minute of it.